I know you you wondering why it's red, because it's red everywhere, man. It's red everywhere, man. Good God. Tyronebird.com. I mean, I Tyrone, do I wait for two minutes so I can start my rant? Tyronebird.com, man. Come on, man. Just we gotta think about this for a minute. We got we just got we gotta think for a minute. Hold up a minute, man. We got we gotta go back. Everybody take a deep breath. Take a deep breath. Jackson, the tight end. Who? Rashawn Jackson, the tight end. Who? Rashawn Jackson, the tight end. And we were deep talking breath. about this, the no margin for error for Colorado State. Well, there was a serious error take right a deep there. Take a deep breath. There was a brain cramp. Either linebacker or a safety Oof. did not make the adjustment in the Deep formation bush. to cover the tight end. He was 10 yards. I'm still with the bush. Till we win. Trying to hang on. Like a hubcap in the fast lane. But I want to cut it so bad. We have to win. I don't know what the spread is against Ohio State, but come on, Scars. We can pull off. We can do the unthinkable. We can do the unthinkable. We can do the unthinkable. That was after a loss at Arizona State. Playing against Colorado State first quarter. Um, I wasn't really playing, playing, but I would get in on passing plays and just happen to catch the ball in those situations. And so, um, let's everybody take a deep breath. Take five. There we go. Okay. Purdue debacle. Purdue super meltdown. Purdue, Purdue, Purdue. Nebraska suffers worst loss of the year. It don't get no worse than this. We can't, we gotta go up from here. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going up from here. Throw out their Scott Frost get fired stuff. Just stop with that, okay? Just, just stop it, all right? Stop it. All the Husker fans, stop with the fire Scott Frost, please, okay? Let Coach Frost do what he's here to do. Coach football for the season, period. Give him that opportunity. Don't leave the stadium. You never know. More people was there. We probably could have got it. I'm not saying that. I'm just saying that. Where do we go from here? Somebody tell me. Where do we go from here? Positively, where do we go from here? We know what the negative is. I ain't talking negative. I'm talking positive. Where do we go from here? Because you can't fire anybody right now, okay? Coach Frost is the coach. Let them finish the year out. Then you can discuss whatever you want to. But right now, TyroneBird.com. Black shirt insurance coverage. I mean, somebody's got to be, do something. You got to do something that can help you. You need insurance policies. In case of a rainy day. TyroneBird.com. Questions, questions, questions. Concerns. I said, where do we go from here? One of my biggest, I was in the house, I was in the building. One of my biggest hangups was why didn't we try a backup quarterback? Where was to the backups, Smothers and, and my guy from Carney, to, to, to the backups, what does that say about them if the guy can throw for three picks? in the most critical situations, because we're going to talk a little bit about some of those situations. And it's going to be my uh, TyroneBird.com set the stage moment. I only say that because it's, we got to set the stage. I asked earlier in the season, who are we as far as our, our identity? Who are we? We know we got the black shirts. But offensively, who are we? What's our identity? 
Everybody talking about Martinez leaving. Leaving and going where? Where is he going to leave and go to? Nowhere. Martinez needs to come back for another season and see if he can get it done. And if he can't, let's replace him. But after the second pick probably was enough for me to say, hey, sit down, young man, take a breath. We're going to try the young buck and see what we got going. Because they set the stage. Once we set this stage, you're going to see that these were these moments that this um, airhead mentality kicks in are at critical times. When we're in a good situation, where all I think we need to do is run yet. Run him. Give it to him. Six carries, 60 yards. Come on, man. Six carries, 60 yards. I don't care if he went the wrong way. It gives you an opportunity to hit a big play. So if he goes the wrong way two and he hits a big play one, I'll take that. I'll take that percentage. What if Martinez leaves? We're going to go get Spencer Rattler? Have you a one-hit wonder? Think Spencer Rattler want to come here and get his head knocked off? I'm not saying he's going to get his head knocked off. And Spencer Rattler could come here and ball out. I don't know. Somebody help me out. But it's red everywhere. We need something to feel good about. Hold on a minute. We need something to feel good about. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Let's feel good about something real quick. We need something to feel good about. Like I said, it's red everywhere, man. I, get, I had to take that. But it, it takes me back. To how can you not play, you know, sit a guy down for a little bit. Maybe he needs to take a breath before we continue to make him, let him make bonehead decisions. And how many picks is too many before we say, okay, let's sit him down. Let's see what our backup can do. Because we haven't seen him. We've seen him and he's looked good, Smothers and others. And I'm just saying, but... In that situation, I, I probably would have played my second guy. Wouldn't have mattered to me. Just for a series. Couldn't have did any worse. Could have done better, though. The outcome could have been better. But again, it takes me back to um, Arizona State 1996. Takes me back to that game. It was a game there. It was an ugly game. We struggled. And even at the end of that game with seven minutes ago, I think I think uh, Terman went into the game um, just to finish the game up. And I think that was just a smart move. But uh, some of the some of the words that I heard after the in the press conference by Amart were uh, said he felt comfortable. Um, you know, got to go watch the film. Um, got to go do this. We got to go do that. You know. As players, as coaches, at some point, we all have to just say, okay, that's our fault. We blew it. I don't know what else to say. Next question. I blew. I helped blow the game by not playing well, overthrowing, making bad decisions. What happened again? How did Yant go from, from that to, to dis, disappearing? It was a close game. All the way to the fourth quarter to the onside kick. We had 115 yards rushing in the first half. We had 15 yards rushing in the second half. Fueled by throwing the ball. Fueled by... Minus four turnovers. It's not time to throw the baby out with the bath water, though. This is the bed that we're all in. You have to figure out a way. Now, practice makes perfect. What's happening at practice that we're not practicing the way we play? Or we don't even feel comfortable with the backup. So let's stop the frost, the fire frost business. Give them an opportunity to finish the year out. See how this is going to play out.
but never leave your soldiers. Sometime as a coach, we, we you get fed up, I get it, and, and you don't know what else to do. But there, there might not be a magic speech, but there's some good speeches that can get some players fired up and ready to play. Ready to match energies to somebody that's in our house. Let the year play out. Let's see what the rest of the year has to hold. And let's stay let's stick in there. That's that that's it. That is what I can say. Um They really had a lackluster offensive day. I mean the quarterback did well, but I didn't think we blitzed enough. I didn't think we put enough pressure on that quarterback in order to be successful. I mean Connor Coke, uh, I think his name is Turner Cochran. I mean, he played a decent game, but boy, a couple of plays, he just got beat horribly. And I know he's a freshman, or no, he's not. I mean, he ain't a true freshman, but he's a freshman, but come on, man. We got to be able to hold up on the backside. Left tackle. Let's set the stage. First of all, we have TyroneBird.com moment. Let's try it. Again. Let's go. Real, real. Sean Jackson, the tight end. For Sean Jackson, the tight end. For Sean Jackson, the tight end. Wide open, scoring. Okay, so let's just wait. Stop for a minute. I just wanted to get a little bit of some positive action, some positive. Take a deep breath, man. I feel for the young men playing. But uh, because I think the backups is, I was a backup. Didn't play in the Arizona State game besides on special teams. Played in Colorado State game. I'm watching that game now, and I played during the catching of the ball. I would imagine I played a little bit more because I was, anyway. We won't toot our own horn. Let's set the stage. This is my TyroneBird.com set the stage moment. Okay. So Nebraska is winning 7-0 to zero at home. Ball is on our 45-yard line. It's second and 15. What do you do? Run the ball! Oh, sorry. I digress. Sorry. 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 That's what it was. And we decided to go in a spread set, have Martinez drop back. We had two receivers to the left side. I think it was Sam Torre. Torre, Torre, Torre. And uh, number five, and uh, Teray might have ran his guy off. Number five's out there, maybe running a, a comeback or something like that. We don't see the this the outside linebacker sneaking over or a strong safety, whichever one you want to call him, sneaking over, and we throw it right to him. That just can't happen in that situation in that moment for pick six to tie the game up at home. Come on, just saying. We're red. I mean, come on. Set the stage again. Set the stage. It's the third quarter. Second and 14. We're leading 17 to 14. We have the ball on the Purdue 45 yard line. Going in. Second and 14. What do you do? Run the ball. No. We go back to throw the ball. He's under duress. I don't know why we just didn't take off and run it. But we try to get to throw a shuffle pass. Why a guy's got our jersey 10 yards down the field to a tight end. At that point, I've seen enough. You need to sit down. I don't know what you're doing. You don't know what you're doing right now. Take a deep breath. 
Smothers, get your ass in the game. And when you did do the shuffle pass, if you'd have looked to the left, Betts was wide open. Anyway, that's another story. Okay, so we watched as the score is 28-17 with 7 minutes and 24 seconds to go. I think it was with 9 and we just couldn't do whatever, whatever. But we were still in the game at this point. Okay, I get it. But I'm going to set the stage one more time. It's 28-17 with 7 minutes and 24 seconds to go in the fourth quarter. First and 10 from R20. We score. We score. It's 28-24. We got seven minutes to go. Let's go. You don't really even got to rush. But yet again, we put the ball up in the air and throw an interception. We overshoot our receiver by 10 yards straight to the safety. And if that's not enough to garner the backup, I don't know what is. But it, let's get going. Let's, you got people sitting over there on the pine. If they, if you, your starting guys are going to continue to. If your starting guys are going to continue to digress, then let's put some new blood in there and maybe get ready for the future. But to live and die at 2 a.m., I don't know. Got to give them a break. Take, a, take, a, take five. Breathe. We have an opportunity. We got three more opportunities. Ohio State's coming to town. You can't cry now. Don't cry now. Ohio State is coming to town. Are you going to lay down and get blown out at home? Ohio State is coming to town. Are we getting blown out at home? Let me say this one more time. Ohio State is coming to town. Are we going to get blown out at home? I sure hope not. I hope we wouldn't give up. And I hope that if a person keep making mistakes, I've never known him to keep planning. Listen. Purdue. I don't want to hear this one score game stuff. That was more than a one score game. Because if it wasn't, we would have won it. Now. You got Ohio State coming in to town, licking their chops. The way you practice this week is the way you guys are going to play. So, I'm just telling you, I would hope and, and pray that we are practicing our asses off in practice. <laughs> Let me say that one more time. Practicing our butts off in practice. Come on. Let's do it. No more excuses. If you lose, we lost. We wasn't good enough. But no more excuses. Do you guys even say the prayer anymore? I'm just asking questions because I don't know. I want to know. Inquiring minds want to know. But TyroneBird.com, he certified in all types of insurance coverages. Whether you're in Arizona or Colorado or even Nebraska, he can help you with all your insurance needs. Get the black shirt coverage you need from TyroneBird.com. Whether we're talking auto, life, business, any type of insurance you need, he can provide. TyroneBird.com. And I mean bird with the Y, not the I. Because the I in the sky don't lie. TyroneBird.com. This three-time national champion for Sean Jackson signing off. Man, listen, until next time, stay tuned for my Ohio State Midnight Prayer to 
the win. Uh, somehow, some way, we uh, do the unthinkable and do the impossible and upset Ohio State. Go be ready.